Yeah, so it's a reading room. It's not for sale. Books not for sale. So we've got a whole lot, uh, a lot of artists and researchers have created these zines. We also have the green co copy of the Goa Green Manifesto that the campaign and other youth groups put together. Uh, and the idea is to inform and engage people with Goa's living environmental ecological heritage and to learn about the campaign and what's kind of happening with the fragmentation of the forests in Mori. So yeah. basically it's an art driven initiative to build awareness. Here yes. And otherwise? And research based also because we have a based. lot of scientists and researchers who work with the campaign. You all are based where? Where? Oh, we don't have, okay. we're not an organization. Virtual. Virtual. I mean, it's basically a group of citizens who volunteered to uh, create this campaign. So these are chap books. You could call them chap books or They're slam books. They're zines. Zines. Yeah. Why not? Why not digital? Where, uh, where are you recording for? YouTube. Okay. Uh, my name is Frederick. Okay. I just have a channel. No, don't worry. I'm just curious because uh, we are into publishing ourselves, but sure. slightly on the slightly not alternative, but uh, not very commercial. Sure. Something called Goa 1556. So I'm just trying to understand your model. So, you know, just to see where, how it could work or, you know, how it could work better. Do you better. know about the Amche Mole campaign? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Gabriela and all. Huh? Gabriela. Gabriela de Cruz was involved earlier. Yeah. yeah. So, yeah. So, what I'm saying is, why not make this into digital products? Which could be, which could be spread on a much uh, faster basis, no? So, a lot of the campaign information that has been created over the last while yeah. is available digitally. I see. So, you know, there's people who've made films on the molecules yeah. and the campaign and what's happening with the infrastructure projects that people have created art, yeah. people have created research and whatever we've had, the, like yeah. everything is publicly available and shared. Very nice. A lot of art input and a lot of research input, that's yes. what you're saying. And also just, I mean, we've also had, you know, children and young people kind of contribute in various ways. And, like there's a lot of engagement from citizens across, across uh, things. Like if you can see over there, right now we're collecting, yeah, that's collecting a campaign. petitions for, yeah. the, so you can see that there's like hospitality sectors represented, there's research scientists, there's veterinarians as well. I so there's, I mean, it's a citizens campaign, yeah, right? Yeah, so whoever yeah, yeah. is cares and whoever's interested can contribute yeah. in whatever they interesting, interesting. So, yeah. so we're all also volunteers. Yeah, yeah. yeah. No, I do sometimes research and writing whenever Your name is Shivangini. Shivangini. Anjora also used to be involved no? at some stage. Anjora from Chora. Um, a long time probably, back, I don't know. I'm I'm, I'm sure. Okay. I, people come and go because yeah, yeah, again yeah, it's yeah, volunteer. Yeah. Uh, I, no, I was 